Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back. I'm Melanie Kate Love. Thank you so much for joining me here for another episode. Today I wanted to continue on with our Law of Attraction series and focus in particular on visualization in the form of vision boards. Now, why I love visualization so much is it literally creates a mini movie within your head and then you connect the emotions associated with when you have already manifested it. It's like living a reality before it's even happened, which is so amazing. Anyways, a way that you can manifest things quickly through visualization is by raising your vibration. The quickest way that I have learned to do that is incorporating self-love practices, which you can check out in this video right here. I go into depth about all the things that I do that make me feel amazing. In other words, just choosing practices that let your inner child play and just have fun. So that's what I have been doing. Also, in addition to that, the other thing that you need to do is to match your emotions associated with that. What we're going to be doing today is breaking down the things that we would like to manifest into our existence. Now you can put whatever you want onto your board. I like to use the categories such as business, health and wellness. Um, I like to think about like house goals. Um, I like to think about things that I would like to own, um, like my personal things. So I kind of break my board up. Now I make my vision board for my phone and for my computer. Um, so whatever works best for you, whatever device you want to put this on, or if you want to print it, then that's wonderful. But I use my phone every day, like multiple times a day. So that works truly best for me. So I wanted to show you a little step-by-step -step guide how I do this. It's very, very simple. When you look at an image, let's just say you want a brand new, what do I want? I want a fiddle leaf fig tree for my house. I don't know, I would, okay. I would really love it to be a real plant, but I'm noticing the price of them is very, is a little more than I want to spend. So what I'm going to be doing is putting that onto my house section of my board. And when I look at that, I'm going to be visualizing how I'm going to feel when I find this plan for a truly amazing price, or maybe it is gifted to me and the feeling associated with it when I bring it into my house and I'm like, oh, greenery, oxygen, mother nature, good chi for the house, for good feng shui if you're into that. So you need to link the five senses to that. And if any, I'm just sitting on the floor and I've got a sore leg, so I'm just gonna sit up like this. So if you have any um, reservations, fears, doubts, um, resistance that comes up with that, then you need to think a better thought and say, it really would be lovely if I could find this fiddle leaf fig and it was very close to my house. It really would be lovely if I could find this fiddle leaf fig and it has um, beautiful, big, fat leaves and it was cared for in a beautiful house with loving energy around it. It really would be lovely if it came with its own um, cement pot that wasn't painted and it had a white painted lip around the top. It really would be lovely if it came with a cement um, little tray for it to sit in and it was painted white. It really would be lovely if it was delivered to my house because I don't know how I would fit it into my car. It really would be lovely if the person that delivered it was super amazing and then we became friends. It really would be lovely if, if they had more of these trees and they were like, hey, if you want one, hey, I've got another one at the back. You want it? Cool. And then I've got two. Do you see what I just did there? Do you see how excited I am just thinking about it? Because I'm like, I'm not gonna move it over there because I've got junk that I've hidden from the screen, but I'm just literally matching my emotions by just visualizing it in my head. Like I feel excited and I feel happy and I can't wait to have this tree into my existence in the physical form because you've been, I've been manifesting it. Well, I've been not spending enough time visualizing. That's why it hasn't come into my existence because there's other things that have been taking preference and I just keep my, thoughts um, at a good vibration, a positive vibration. And if any negative thoughts come into play, I just say it really would be lovely if, and then it just cancels out that thought. Do you see where I'm coming at? 
Raise your vibration, do your self-love practices. It's gonna get you in the vortex quicker, which means it's that's when you're in alignment with your true authentic self. And that is when you are able to visualize what you want. So you're sending rockets of desires out into the universe and they've lined it up for you. And the universe is just waiting for your thoughts to match your desires. And that's when you close the gap and your beautiful, beautiful fiddly fig just manifests, it, manifests itself into the physical form and into your house. Isn't that amazing? That is the law of attraction right there. So I want you to think about what types of things you're going to put into your board. This is gonna be a two part series because I'm already, already at eight minutes. So think about what you want and then we're gonna, I'm gonna show you how to do it on Canva. Are you ready? It's gonna be amazing. Actually, I'll just do it in one video. You guys won't mind. Now nah, you'll be fine. Law of Attraction says you're gonna to continue to watch it because I know that it's that good that you wanna watch it. Anyways, that's where we're at. Well, let's go to canvo.com. Enjoy! Matching your manifestations, raising your vibration, and just elevating your thoughts so your manifestations are matching your desires. You close the gap, beautiful things manifest into your world. Oh my gosh, my battery is dying. Anyways, my love, it's so exciting. Comment below, let me know how you went. If you wanna share your vision board with me, then you can do that through Instagram. You can send me a private message, you know, I'm just really excited to see what you've done and I can't wait to hear the stories when you start to tell me that what you are visualizing is manifesting into your reality because you're raising your vibration, your frequencies. You're doing your self-love practices, which means it's gonna happen super quick. You've got rid of all resistance and you are going downstream. You're going with the speed of the water in your little, um, 
in your boat. You're not paddling upstream anymore because that's what you have been doing and it's not working and it's tiring you out. This is going to be easy for you, my love. It's gonna be so easy. I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching. Hit subscribe so you never miss another episode. There are 75% of you that aren't subscribed. I need to manifest you hitting that subscribe button today and the feelings associated when I check my subscription list, I'm like, holy cow, holy cow, that's amazing. It's just jumped an extra thousand. It's possible because that's how my channel started out. Jumping a thousand subscribers every week and then I blocked it. Do you know how I blocked it? I was like, I was pissed that I was getting a thousand emails from YouTube every week and I was like, you're blocking my inbox. That's how I blocked my channel. Anyways, my love, I'm shouting and I'm getting so excited and my tea is getting cold. It's just like sitting here going, Mel, come on, I'm really, really thirsty. Come and drink me. This just gets me elevated. Oh, it just gets me real G'd up and I'm just like, I'm so excited because it's like, we use our thoughts to manifest anything we want into our physical form, like in our desire, in our reality. Anyways, my love, thanks so much for watching. Remember, continue to make better choices. I will see you next episode. I love you, I love you, I love you. Goodbye.